Good Tuesday morning. What is going on, folks? Just another day in paradise, right? So yesterday I went to the doctor. Some of my uh, subscribers are asking me how am I doing. So I uh, found out I have gout in my right knee. So they gave me uh, antibiotics and some other medicine to take. My boss told me, why don't you just stay home, relax? And I said, no, that's okay, I'll go to work. So, I'm at work. I mean, you know, it is what it is. I had gout before. And, uh, you know, the pain, the pain is bearable. I'm, you know, I mean, it's not that bad. It's, you know, it's gradually getting better. Because I went to see the doctor last night, so. Now, tomorrow, the next day, I'll be back to normal. Well, there's one good thing about today, at least it stopped raining. Today's route, we have uh, 110 stops, 110 on a Tuesday, so as you all know, the heaviest day is Monday and Friday, so Tuesday it's not, not too bad. So that's about, it's about two loads two and a half, depending on how heavy it is out of here, you know what I mean? So I just want to give a shout out to all my new subscribers. I appreciate everybody uh, liking and subscribing and watching my videos and commenting below on, you know, what kind of truck I drive and what make is it, what kind of horsepower. I get a lot of questions every day. I answer all my subscribers. If you have a question, let me know. Comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can, usually at the end of the day when I'm home. Uh, I look at all the comments, uh, look at all the questions. So, whatever question you have, let me know, so uh, I can get back to you, that's not a problem. Uh, this town here alone, in this general town, about 40 stops alone right here in this town. Some of the stops you got to do early because of parking situations. You might not be able to get in. Most of the stops are okay. Like the next stop is a pain in the butt. That's uh, kindergarten, preschool. And the way the container is situated, sometimes you really can't get in there. But that's where we're gonna go right now, check it out. And it's in a, it's kinda in a bad location because when you come around the bend, you really have to swing wide to get into the parking lot. So, you see what I mean in a few minutes. Nobody let you go, nobody, and I mean nobody. Stop right here. 
Now I gotta go all the way to the right. I gotta make this huge left swing. And come into the parking lot. So you just gotta be very, very careful coming in and backing out. That's why I love these new high definition cameras they put on these new trucks. It really helps you see. They work good. I like them. Just mark them off on the tablet. My stuff. Okay. Yeah, these new cameras uh, on these new trucks, as a matter of fact, they're changing out cameras because they're 3D high definition and they're really really clear at nighttime. You see everything that's going on around you. I mean I have cameras on the mirrors, I have cameras on the roof, uh, on the tailgate, and in the front of the truck, one mouth and in the safety. So, you know, God forbid something happens, it's uh, automatically recorded on, on the camera. So it really, really works in your favor. So now the next stop we're going to is uh, a car wash. I don't think it's going to be that busy today because of all the rain yesterday. I don't know. Let's find out. So where this container is located is right where the traffic are lined up to get into the car wash. So in the summertime, you got to get in here early. So let's see how we look. It doesn't look too bad. But yeah, there's one thing about this company. They're, they're big on safety. They actually uh, supply you everything that you need to do the job as far as clothing, uh, work boots, work gloves. In the winter time, they actually give you really, really nice jackets to wear. Uh, keeps you nice and warm, which is something you need on this job, no matter, you know, how cold it is in the winter time, you definitely need a good jacket. And, uh, they're pretty good like that. I know I always talk up about the company, but you know I can't help not because uh, this is about the best company I've ever worked for. They offer you a lot. They give you a lot. Uh, you know, if there's anything you need, they're there for you. seconds to close the gates, you know what I mean? Uh, the other thing is, when you go to a dumpster, put it back to where you found it. Uh, a lot of times, uh, you know, there might be an issue with a lot of garbage around the container, so me personally, I pick up the garbage around the container, throw it back in the container, and, you know, just try to make it look good for me and for the company.
another thing, uh, another reason why I don't listen to the radio. I mean, you know, everybody's different. Everybody does what they do. I'm just saying for me that this is what I do. I don't listen to the radio because if I hear an unusual noise, and you're not going to hear it with that radio on. What's up, Pat? It stopped raining. Yay! <laughs> so, yeah, I don't listen to the radio because like I was saying, you know, if there's a, a sound or some kind of bang or loud noise, you're not going to hear it with the radio on. So that's another reason why I don't listen to it. That's, that's just me. I mean, you know, everybody's different.
they still don't see you. But anyway, that's the way people are. They're always in a rush. Oh, where were you going? Oh, I was in a rush to go to Starbucks to get my coffee. Just say something. You guys really don't give me a lot of room to get in here. And if I hit one of these cars, that's on me. No, I know it's not. Know it's not man. You're the only one that does help me, man. I appreciate it, bro. Just can you watch the front of it so I don't. Oh, 